October 22, 1836, General Sam Houston was sworn in as the first president of the Republic of Texas. As a teenager, after his father died, Houston ran off to live with the Cherokee Indians on the Tennessee River, being adopted by Chief Uluteka and given the name Raven. Three years later, Houston returned to town, opened a school, joined the army, and fought in the War of 1812, being noticed by General Andrew Jackson. In 1818, wearing Indian dress, Sam Houston led a delegation of Cherokee to Washington, D.C. to meet with President Monroe. Elected to Congress in 1823, Sam Houston became governor of Tennessee in 1827. After a failed marriage, Sam Houston moved to Texas, where he was made commander to fight Santa Ana. The Texas Declaration of Independence stated, when a government has ceased to protect the lives, liberty, and property of the people and becomes an instrument in the hands of evil rulers for their oppression, it is a sacred obligation to their posterity to abolish such government and create another in its stead. The Texas Declaration ended, conscious of the rectitude of our intentions, we fearlessly and confidently commit the issue to the decision of the supreme arbiter of the destinies of nations. Hey everyone, hope you enjoyed the video. To see more like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button below. Get all the latest content from TCT Ministries. We'd love to pray alongside you for God's blessings in your life, so you can email your prayer requests to prayer at tct.tv or click the link below and submit your request at tct.tv. God bless you and thank you for watching.